Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to The Book of Blood, which is a horror game from the creator of the Mortuary Assistant, part of the 5th Dread X Collection. And in this game, you find a book, and you must use that book to banish an evil clown to the Shadow Realm. One here? Yeah, it's uh, it's been a busy one. I have some things I need to set up for tomorrow. Shh, sucks for you. Hey, man, we can't all just wander around in a suit pretending to work. Screw you, man. This <laughs> takes talent. How about you have Amy conjure up some overtime for me, there, magician? Nepotism. I won't stand for it. So you want me to wait for you? Nah, it won't take too long. I'll see you tomorrow. Alright, just remember to lock the gate. Amy was pissed last time, dude. Oh, wait, there's something down here. It's some weird-ass book. Um, I, I don't know. This looks like it belongs to, like, maybe the psychic or something? I, I don't know. Put in your lost and found. We'll figure out who it belongs to tomorrow. I got one last trick. I'm gonna disappear. Later, dude. Stupid. Alright, I'm gonna take a look at that list. So... Am I, like, a lot higher than you were, or were you really short? Put book in back. Trash, check air tanks. Put money in safe, lock back door, turn off music. Okay. What's this? I can look out of my trailer, and that is upsetting. This is very upsetting. Oh no. There is a power junction mechanic. Oh no. Can't leave yet. Need to get my stuff done. This is gonna be one of those like management kind of things. Money. So anyway, book. A strange book that might belong to one of the booths here. Place him back. What's weird about? Get my stuff done. Okay. Put money in safe, lock back door, turn off music. Money. Earnings for the day needs to be put in the safe in the back. Okay. Lock back door. Bam. Leslie. Here we go and turn off music. All right. What up? <gasps> you scared the shit out of me, man. Wait, who are you? What the fuck? Look, man, you need to leave. We're closed right now. Oh god. Killer mimes. What the hell? Let me in. Oh, you, you are fast. Everything's locked, that's good. Oh god! No! Don't do it! Ah. Wait. What the hell was that? Where's the first aid kit? First aid kit. Damage restored. to keep the doors locked. They were locked. It teleports in, practically. Now I need power. One of the junction boxes must be out. I should check the breaker in the back to see which ones. I need to get the power back on. 
Oh god. Two and three. So, two and three, we are... Okay. I don't fully understand where they are. Crouch just stay quiet, I can't even see. Should be to my right and uh, straight forward. Might have to be clowns. Here's one. Oh god. Even the turning on the junction box is, like, tedious. There's so many ways that we are exposed and can be attacked. I'm gonna fall... Clown? Clown? Where are you teleporting, clown? That thing could be anywhere. Could be even over there! Over here! Or even over there. Feeling pretty vulnerable. It's kind of like a dead end. Oh no. There's a thing on the top left. Is it reading my mic or testing one, two, three, testing my mic? No, it's just moving. It's my movements. Because there's a thing in the top left. That's what I was wondering. White spray paint. Okay. Sure. Okay, so you can defend yourself. Okay, let's go back and, uh... Do the junction box. Now that we know the clown is technically everywhere and anywhere at the same time. Should have power. I'm unsure... Fully how the stealth mechanic works. Like, is there a race? I don't know. Was it safe or not safe to move? No! <laughs> yeah, me, evil clown! Woof. Okay, power's back. What's this book about? Let's see. Age not yet determined. Possibly 1300s. Item... Find me something important. While filing my work for a day, a colleague had found this manuscript reportedly hidden inside the lining of a steamer trunk found in the most recent shipment of antiquities. Upon first inspection, there are a number of intriguing aspects of this book. I will be recording my findings and complying everything as I perform my work. Note, Edwin, this print is heavily faded apart from what looks like a tile page of the word blood, which gives the estimate age's book could probably be Middle English. Uh, yeah, that is useless, useless, useless. Text is basically unreadable, looks like pages have been written on multiple times different languages. There's also a number of strange pictographs created of newer ink. It's a very peculiar find, while the faded writing... 
Better not be something attacking. Hey. I saw you unlock that door. Replace when the battery dies. So we're not safe when we're reading the book. Court has two moving parts. Controlled by a center button. We're looking to rotate the holes in the cruising. Let's reveal something in the book. Hmm. Check my doors. It's out there in the dark. My documentation may become a guide forever should I die. I believe he's trying to keep me from himself in the book. I hate to write such old piece, but I believe they created these images should attempt to stop us, so I should do the same. I'll well, summon them all of symbol of the sun would appear at the top of the page. Oh, God. Turn the ring they have a sun at the top and sudden look at the page of the book for this ring believing the lens and they'll may reveal something. The ring has the proper image at the top, can reveal hand symbols in the ambient pages. When the scary symbol for the lens it becomes burning on the circle of the ninth page. Something horrible I simply cannot fathom is bound to this book, and I believe completing the circle is the answer to stopping it. There's an illustration that appears to be taking some sort of seance. Some look around the same as the one on the ninth page. Some of it was foreign to me, but looks similar to the bind rune as if something is meant to be bound by this book. Kept it locked away. The book was meant to contain it. The symbols are the key. Okay, all these pages are blank. This is a very involved game. It's a loose paper. Back up with this oil like substance on. It's clearly some sort of pattern, but too faint to make out. I'm going to try and obtain an ultraviolet light from the con conservation department to test for phosphors. I'm scared to leave this room, but the substance may be UV sensitive if Cleo's solving this. Interesting. I'm going to die. There's a little more I can do but leave where I find my notes. I believe the only way to stop this is to find all the symbols and complete the circle on the ninth page. We've come to understand. Adjust the card to match the answer of each pictograph. Move the card over the pages of this book while looking for the card's lenses to discover all the symbols. My theory, based on illustration, is to draw the circle on the ground and place the book in the center once completed. I hope this will trap whatever it is has been let loose. I don't believe there are any symbols to be found before the title page of this book. No, no. Nope. Yeah, I saw you do that. No, 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 no. As long as those doors are locked, I'm safe. Okay. Oh, crap. Two and eight. And it's all the way over to Psychic's place. UV. Would this be a UV place? Yeah. Okay. Interesting. This game is actually just not just a... Spooky, scary game. It, it's actually, um... It's got some smarts to it, which is a little weird. I know it's a bad thing. It's just, uh... 
Usually scary clowns are like shock of the shock, right? Oh god. I thought I was dead. Go spooky. Beware. That's my fortune. Getting first aid. Past and future. Cut that out. <laughs> Zykursus, you've done the quick time event. I'll get you next time. Dang demonic clowns. Better look out the side window before I go out there. I don't want to let that thing again. Okay. Back in business. Got something. Gah! Got one symbol and you like turn off the power right away? Hey, fair. Get the power back on. Just use a flashlight. Anyway. One, two, and six. So there. There. Six is all in the south near the bathroom. It's great. Two down, time to get jump scared. You predictable clown bastard. You don't think I know your games? I know you clowns work. We're all agents of chaos in the end. Should be one nearby. Look at me. What the? <laughs> oh, yeah, this door wasn't locked. I don't understand the logic of, like, does that just randomly attack you, or what? Well, we got something. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Get out of here. Get out of here. Got never one. You 
always turn off my power as soon as I get a symbol, don't you? Hey. You wanna... You wanna go away? Guess what door I'm not going outside. You, you, uh... I will spray paint you. I have spray paint. So this time it's one, five, and seven. One, five, and seven. Okay. That's right. Never one done. That's what it does. Okay, let's get back on this book. Nope. You ain't climbing around. Nope. Whoa. Right at my door. Just want to solve your book in peace and banish you to the Shadow Realm. Jeez. Yep. I keep hitting that wrong button on that. You should, uh, chill out. Well, anyway. Triple and eight. Mm, triple's always a convoluted one. Eight's in the psychic. Annoying. We are gone. I'm gonna go out the door you were at. Just because I can. Never round done. I'm pretty sure the spray paint's gonna be for the uh, end game. You gotta make the ritual circle with banish, see a clown or mime, whatever. <laughs> Hey. 
Yeah, that's right. Okay, we're in. So looking at the book... We need one more symbol, I believe. Nope. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Got him. Complete a book. Now what? I gotta like place this somewhere, but where? Oh, here. I don't have it. Oh, God. Why? Why? Why would you help him? What have you done? What have I done? Oops. Oh, the Book of Blood. So it looks like we goofed. So the the clown mine that was attacking us was our co-worker. And if we go on the assumption they had no ill intentions, I guess as soon as they touched the book, they're possessed. They became a host for whatever, you know, controls you. And in most cases, it possesses someone and murders someone and drinks their blood and then it goes away. But we followed the instructions, which weren't about unsummoning the evil. We were doomed from the start, by the way. It was about releasing this evil blood demon of corn into the world. So, good job, us. We died, and we unleashed the demon. But at least we got revenge on our co-worker, which is the good thing. Uh, but yeah, that actually was a pretty solid horror game. The gameplay loop gets a little bit old because it becomes kind of the same. I mean, it's part of the Dread X collection. These games are somewhat more limited in scope and scale because the loop was you open the book, you occasionally check the doors, make sure it's not unlocking it, and then you look for the symbols and you need like five of the symbols or whatever. And every time you get a symbol, the lights are going to go off. You got to go out there, do the quick time event, then not get stabbed and so on and so on. The actual scares 
portions, like this jump scares and everything, are actually pretty good. Like I said, it's just the gameplay loop gets kind of old after like the third symbol or so. Then you're like, alright, I kind of know everything the game has to offer now. But it's a uh, overall solid pretty indie horror game. It has a, uh, has kind of a nice intense feeling to it. Anyway, so thank you all for watching me play The Book of Blood. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.